Hello guys, welcome back to TechNetic YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to discuss about to create local variable and in the next video, we will see we will see all the uh, updated thing. Okay, and uh, local uh, local variable instance variable and static variable too. if till this video, if you have any kind of doubt, then please let us know we will we will try to sort it out. Okay, so let's start our video. So we need to firstly firstly we need to create one Java project. This is how we create Java project. Let's suppose variable. This is this is our Java project name. Let's finish this. Okay. This this is the kind of package we will get. We will create one package in this source folder. Let's say uh, let's say learn. Okay, learn is our package name. Now we will create one Java file. Okay, or class file. Where, where is our class file name? Okay, where is our class? So this is how public class where. This is how one class file declare or start. Okay, let's see. Let's create one public static void main string. Sorry. Okay. See. Whatever the thing will work in Java or the output you see in Java program, it will run only in main program. Okay, only whatever the whatever the thing or whatever the program or whatever the output will come in Java program, it will come whatever we write in this main method. Okay, so this is very important thing. You always need to remember this thing. Okay, now as you know, system out dot if we want to print anything in Java, we need to use this method, okay? RCs or let's say tag natives, okay? Let's run this program. This is how our output is coming, right? So if now if we want to declare our first local variable in this Java program, then how do we uh, introduce or how do we initialize or declare that uh, local variable to so to declare this initial uh, local variable we we can write in this manner int x int x we have declared the local variable declared the local variable okay why this is local variable because x is limited accessibility to only only in this main method from this to this from this block only this block in this block we can access the x variable okay if now how can we initialize one uh, local variable x is suppose x in x is 3 okay so this is how this line shows initialization of initialization of local variable okay yeah now if we if we put this x here and run the program run the same program we will see the output is 3 okay now let's change the value we will see the output again 6 okay so whatever whatever we put here the output will come as like this okay maybe there is some spelling mistake so please ignore that and please i am very sorry for that okay because to make you understand it will be little bit uh, okay so now can we can we do both things in one line like declaration or initialization yes of course we can do both things in one line how in x is equal to 7 we have declared that uh, x is a variable with the data type of integer and we have initialized also in the same line with the, with giving some value like 7 okay okay so variable declared or initialize control s and then run okay let's suppose uh, suppose let's say this time we need to uh, we need to have some string type of data okay uh, name okay and whatever the string we will write we always write that in double comma okay like this 
T E C H N E T I Z. But we can put it out anything whatever we want to hear. Put now we can use this, and this is how a string type of data we can print in Java program. Tech that is okay. So I hope you got this video. You understand the whole content. In the upcoming video, we will see static variable. How to declare or initialize the static variable? How to uh, declare instance variable? How to use that in program? Okay. So thank you for watching this video. Hope this video uh, clear everything. If you have any kind of doubt, then please do comment it out. Do subscribe our YouTube channel so that everything will be resolved in very smooth manner. Thank you for watching this video.